is another level right here, man. You gotta have that push about you. You make you strive to your best abilities. It just keeps evolving, keeps changing, keeps changing. It teaches you very good discipline and, and self-responsibility. It's always challenging, it never gets easy. If anything, it keeps getting harder. This would definitely be the hardest thing I have to do, but I love to do it, so therefore, I come out here every day. You just don't get this anywhere else. It's intimidating, you know? Yeah. I can I can only imagine, I mean, it's because it's so hard, so like, hey, I don't know if I want to do that again, but you just got to push through it. If you can do this, you can do anything. It's all in your head. If you want to try it, good luck. Because if you can survive this, you know, everything else is easy, man. Definitely unique. He's always changing it up. It's like he doesn't run out of material. <laughs> he pushes you to where you think you can't go, and he makes you do it. What coach brings to me and to everybody else is that one-on-one -on -one time, that love, that attention, and that's what sets him apart. We got the best coach in the world, and nobody else trains harder than us. He knows everything, man. He's a machine. Yeah. He's not human. <laughs> Football, basketball, baseball, soccer, I played them all. Nothing gave me that challenge like boxing. And plus, boxing was not a team sport, it was an individual sport. So I had to rely on myself, and I liked that. I liked what I felt, so I went with it. So 1996 was when I had that epiphany of doing this. I said, you know, I would really like to have my own boxing gym. I would really like to train fighters. But it wasn't just about making a living, it was about helping others. And through that means, I found a means to make a living. Jab's team is comprised of many different walks of life. You have young men, you have young women. Some people are here for the fitness, some people are here for the self-defense, and some people are here for competitive boxing. I will tell you that what we do is very tough. Everything about boxing is very hard. Physically, it's demanding. Mentally, it's demanding. Um, ESPN has ranked this as the number one toughest sport out there. This pushes you to limits that you really didn't know you had. It pushes you beyond those limits. Some people like that, they like that challenge. Just walking through the door is the hardest part. Parents started to see a change in their kids, so they started telling other parents about jabs, about what, what I do. And from that point, I started coming across more I guess the juvenile system labels them at-risk kids. I started working with these at-risk kids and showing them that there are more positive things that you can be doing outside of walking around the streets or, or getting into trouble, doing you know all the wrong things. So I gave them an outlet and they like it. A lot of gyms, they don't focus on the youth that are there. They focus on the professionals. They're looking for that big payday. My motto is you teach the skill, but you coach the skill. It's not so much the building, it's not so much the equipment, but it's the knowledge that you're gaining. It's that sense of family that we have. To see someone set a goal in life and achieve it because you've helped them, to be there for someone because they need you. Anything that I can do to help others, that sums it up right there.